guys. So today I'm here to share with you this B6 size traveler's notebook. I had gotten an email from someone who requested a coffee and tea themed traveler's notebook and this is what I created. I think it came out really, really cute. This is using the Doodlebug Cream and Sugar Collection and I just love how it turned out. So this is not Christmas, but um, I, this is just basically what I've been working on. I also want to apologize. I recently got a comment from someone asking if I could do other projects. And I have other projects lined up. Um, everything's written down. All my ideas and things are ready to go. I'm going to start pre-filming for my 25 days of Craftsmas next week. So I'm just saving everything for December. So right now, you just got to kind of bear with me. I get mixed reviews. Some people... You know say they could watch my traveler's notebook videos every day and some you know people are like um, could you show something else I'm just sharing with you guys what I've been working on um, which just happens to be TNs because they get people emailing me and stuff so yeah this is just what I worked on I just finished this tonight actually and I love how it came out so on the front cover I have this cute coffee paper from the collection I think it is so freaking adorable. I have this pink elastic holding in my inserts as well as wrapped around the front cover. And then I have this cute little bow charm that I made. I went ahead and added a little lobster clasp so she can remove this if she wants. So let's just go ahead and take you guys in on the inside. So I went ahead and created this pocket. Um, I had tried this with a micro TN, except I did the pocket going this way. I'll try and find that video and link it down below in case you guys are interested. Um, but yeah, I, I, for some reason, when I had the pocket going like this, when I would close it, the pocket would kind of buckle a little bit. Um, not a lot, but it just kind of irritated me. So I figured I would try the side pocket. Um, and I really like how it turned out. I think it's so cute and I love this side pocket anyway. Um, I just have some cut aparts in this collection. So there's my favorite things and then this little donut and then this little coffee die cut. Really cute. She asked for a shaker and that's what I did. I have some sequins um, that coordinate with the colors of the collection and then there's little die cuts in here. There's two donuts but they're stuck together. And then there's a couple little hearts, so you got to kind of shake it around. But I love how this, um, but I love how the colors of this shaker came out. Really, really cute. So she wanted uh, four inserts, so that's what I went ahead and did. Each insert has 40 lined pages, and I went ahead and created this cute little paper clip from the ephemera pack from the collection, and I added a little silver paper clip so it matches the silver lobster clasp on the front. Um, yeah, and I went ahead and laminated it and everything. Super cute. So on the inside, I have this laminated card. Since she loves tea and coffee, I tried to incorporate that as much as I could. So that says, so happy together. And so here's the back of the shaker pocket. So it's just a little 4x6 plastic sleeve that you can put a photo in, anything you want, journaling card. Here I just have a... Um, cut apart from the collection it says sugar and spice and everything nice um, then I have the second insert with another laminated card that says you warm my heart with the coffees super cute and I learned this tip from my friend Leone so I just added the folder to the center of this um, insert so I thought that was really smart that she did that so I'm going to probably do that in my December daily. So thank you so much, Leonie, for the inspiration. So here I created a page marker that she requested. Um, I went ahead and added some little cut parts to the collection, a few little stickers. Um, this little coffee paper clip is from the collection. I just had it in my stash. Um, I also added um, an extra paper clip that I thought I was going to use, but I ended up not using. So just a bunch of little goodies in there for her to play with. And then I have the pen loop over here. This is one of those Pentel RSVP pens. Then I added the little coffee bean paper so it matched the front cover. And then I have a little donut paper clip up here. So here's the third insert with another little laminated card. And then here's another folder in that um, insert. She didn't ask for two folders, but I feel like 
I'm kind of OCD and I need like symmetry. So if there's a folder in one, like I just need a folder in the other. Yeah. <laughs> so I have the last insert and then here again is another laminated card. Here's the back pocket and then I have some more cut aparts from the collection. This cute little sugar guy. So that is pretty much it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you're not subscribed, you can go ahead and do so by clicking the subscribe button. And then if you want to know every time I upload a video, just go ahead and hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Love you guys. Bye.